Hey, what's up guys? It's Jay here from 360 Studios, and today we're going to be taking a little look at wrestling in the game. So, this is my Street Fighter Zangief looking dude, who is part of Team Gra Grappler's Quest, uh, who are known for their grappling and wrestling and BJJ credentials. So, we're just going to click on choose, and we will be presented with the Grappler's Quest gym. Isn't it beautiful? So, uh, cancel. We're gonna go to training. There it is. And we are gonna select ourselves an introduction to wrestling. Now, uh, the positive thing about wrestling is great defense. Uh, holds reduce opponent's stamina. So this is one of the secondary effects. Um, and takedowns which can be used to control fights <clears throat> uh, a negative of wrestling is fewer strikes and submissions so let's click into wrestling and begin our introduction to the discipline so here in our intro we're going to train with Sam Oropesa uh, we've got to retain more health um, and then obviously we gain more stars the more times we hit Sam. We've got to do all that within two, within five turns. So here is our head coach and he says this is wrestling. It's great for controlling and transitioning a fight. Let's try a wrestling move card against your opponent. So we're going to click one of these and lock it in for attack. Each discipline has special move cards that have bonus effects. Wrestling uses holds. When they defend, they reduce the stamina of your opponent that they would gain. Tap and hold the move. So if we tap our secondary effects here, we'll see the secondary effects uh, description, which is a hold. Uh, the opponent receives one less stamina next turn. So let's lock it in. <clears throat> so we defend our opponent's attack. And you can see like the little red hold icon come up, uh, which means that they have got less stamina this turn. Uh, another secondary effect is takedown. So uh, our head coach says wrestling is all about takedown attacks to transition the fight to the ground. Tap and hold to see the effect. So this is a body takedown, and takedown is the secondary effect, and transitions the fight to the ground. So we just basically take our opponent down. Let's lock that little baby in. So takedowns, you know, you can make use of them when you know that you're stronger than your opponent on the ground. Say your disciplines are BJJ and wrestling, for example then you can utilize the takedown secondary effects to take, your, take the opponent down to an area that you're more comfortable in and that you might have stronger attacks in. So our head coach says all disciplines have KO or submission move. Your opponent has a submission move card. So our opponent here is trying to submit us, but we will not let that happen. So tap, 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 tap. Great recovery. Being knocked out or submitted ends a fight instantly. Now let's see if you can finish strong. You have some great move cards there. So that'll do it. And we've won the training session. So we've learned about holds and about takedowns there. So holds um, are used to reduce your opponent's stamina, which obviously will limit the amount of attacks 
they can use in that turn. And takedowns, obviously, taking it to the ground to hopefully give you the edge. So now that we've completed that introductory training session, we have earned our new move, which is double underhooks. Sweet. And we move on to our next sparring challenge. Um, so here, basically, we've got a... Uh, we get three stars for finishing with five or more health. Uh, two for three, one for one. So let's see how we do here. Right, okay, let's look. So here we have a takedown secondary effect. Um, they have pretty good defense cards. It covers all the different areas of the body. Let's go with head and legs attacks. So we haven't defended the head, which is cool for us, but this leg attack will be defended. We still have more health than them, which is cool. Uh, we're gonna use this move here, which defends our body and our head. And you see now we've defended the takedown which is the secondary effects of our opponent. Um, but it still goes through because not all the damage was defended. Uh, we can try and get back up now by using this stand up secondary effect. And we're just gonna go all out. So the stand up secondary effect that we've just attacked with hasn't been defended. So this will take the fight back to the feet And, you know, we've got a huge advantage here. We've just got to... Uh, I'm going to defend the takedown again. Which I've... Yep, yeah. so it's successfully defended the takedown now because we blocked all the damage from our opponent. And hopefully now we're going to finish him off. Yeah, so he didn't defend the head attack, so you see his health's gone down to zero. So basically, they are the fundamentals of wrestling. Holds, uh, takedowns, uh, transitions. Uh, wrestling is really good for taking down your opponent, uh, for limiting their stamina, to limit their attacks. Uh, so it, it's, it's very control-based wrestling. So there you go. And um, we've earned a new move. This video, uh, thanks for watching. And there'll be more videos to come uh, talking through the, the other dis different disciplines that you can utilize in the game. And yeah, so thanks for watching and see you next time, guys.